In today's video, I'm going to be giving you a full beginner's guide to the Upromote Affiliate Marketing Shopify app. So the first thing you want to go ahead and do is actually install it onto our store. And to do this, we can go onto the Shopify app store, find the app, and then click the install button here. Once we've done that, it's gonna go ahead and open up the tab here. We press install. And after a few seconds, it should install onto your store ready to go. So once you've installed it and created an account, it's gonna bring you through some onboarding questions. So just go through these and answer these and on, as honestly as possible. And once you've done that, you can start the quick setup. So we're gonna go ahead here and click get started. And the first thing is going to ask us the commission structure. So first of all, it's the tracking method. We can do affiliate links and coupons. We can select both of those. Affiliate link basically is a link that has someone's name or something at the end of it. And that will be able to, you can track where the purchase come from. Affiliate coupon is basically a coupon code. So if someone uses that coupon code at checkout, you can track it's come from them. So next up, we've got the commission type. We can do a percent of sale. We can do a flat rate per item. Or we can do a flat rate per order. So this is what the affiliate will get paid out. So you can do 10% as a commission, or you can do a commission on the item. This is a pound amount or you can do per order and do a pound amount so I'm just gonna leave it at 10 pound per order now I'm gonna click next here and I'm gonna go and click next again and lastly we're going to select the payout methods that your affiliates can have so select the methods that you want to offer once we've done that we can press save and finish and we can go to the home section so the first thing we want to do now is we want to go over to where it says programs and in here, this is going to show the different affiliate programs that we actually have. So we can create a new program here by pressing add program. We can put a name in here, so we can type, call it anything, Let's call it P1. Status, that will turn it on. And this is the description. And you can just put anything in here. This is what you're going to be telling your affiliates. So refer a friend and get 10 pound off, for example. In here, we can sort out the commission structure. So Again, the same as before, we can do a fixed commission and we can pick one of these types or we can do an advanced one. And this here is going to be sort of like a tiered system where the more they refer, the better their commission becomes. So it's an incentive for people to actually spend more time on your affiliate program. So you can go ahead and add them in here. Next up, we can turn the commission calculations on or off. So we probably want to exclude shipping. And we want to exclude taxes as well. And you can set up the tax inside of Shopify. Now in the advanced setting, we can set up different um, features. So discounts for customers, new customer commission. We can turn all of these different ones on here if we would like to. And excluding self-referrals means that people can't refer themselves to get a discount. Lastly, we've got our payment methods here and we can select a default payment type. So we can press save there and let me just put this onto simple. Let me put a percent in, and that will save the program here so people can use that. Now, as well, what you can do is you can set up commission for specific products. So you can click here and you can add a product. And you can add a specific commission for that product there, just like that. Next up, we're going to go down to the affiliates tab. And this is the people that we have who are affiliates for us. We can either add one here by putting their name in, or we can import them via CSV. And if you click here and download, this is going to download a CSV file, which you can open up in Google Sheets, something like that. And that way you can import people in bulk. This is just a good way to keep track of all the affiliates. Next up, we've got the referral section. So we can manually add referrals. So we can select a um, order ID and put the ID in there and we can assign to a specific affiliate if they have uh, referred someone. Now this is good for if you are referring clients who might not go for a link or might not use a coupon code. Generally this is good for if you've got high um, average order value for the referrals if it's like one-off things or that kind of thing. Then you can do this just like that. You can also import that via CSV. Next up, we've got the payout section. So payments are made outside of the app, but you can go in here and you can mark it as paid on, on the app here, just like that. 
Next up, we've got motivation. So this is sort of promotional resources, stuff like that. And we can click on these, and these are going to be coupon codes, stuff like that, which you can send to your affiliates and they can send to their customer base or whatever. And this is really useful because it just makes it easy for your affiliates to be sending them to people. If I go back, we can have a look at the media gallery so we can add some links, some other affiliate material that they can use to help promote your brand. Again, we've got gifts. So this is a good way to get your affiliate started, offer them some kind of welcome package. And then we have bonuses as well which again, if they hit a specific target, you can give them some kind of bonus, which is another incentive for them to actually go ahead and become an affiliate. Next up, we have the outreach section. And outreach is just gonna be getting your existing customers, or anyone for that matter, to actually become an affiliate. So we've got customer referral. This is for a customer. Once they've ordered something, you can send them this here. And this is going to ask them if they want to refer their friend in order to get a discount or some money back. We've got some other marketing stuff here that you can look at. We've got this post purchase pop up. So this is going to be once someone purchases, it will pop up on the screen and ask them to refer a friend. We've got marketplace listings and they have their own marketplace of like affiliate offers. So you can list your offer on there and you might get random people who want to go ahead and apply to be an affiliate for your brand. And then we've got this one as well for just normal customers, get them to do it. And then we have the automatic emails and the chat with affiliate section that you can chat with the affiliates just like that. Next up we have analytics. And this is where you're gonna be able to see the amount of traffic that your affiliates are bringing in. It will show your total referrals, total sales, clicks, commissions, referral source. All of that kind of stuff is gonna be all in here in one place. Then we've got the settings tab. So this is going to be things like your contact details, notifications, codes, your product analytics, payments, integrations. So you might have software such as Clavio that you want to integrate with. Fraud detection. So if people are spamming it, you can turn this off. And you've got some other settings down there. Lastly, you have pricing. And this is how much the app actually charges you. Now, for a lot of the features, you're going to need this plan here. You can start off with the free one, but it's not going to be super effective. But that's basically a tutorial for beginners of how you use UpPromote affiliate marketing app for Shopify. If you enjoyed the video and found it useful, be sure to like and subscribe. And also comment down below that the video helped you out so other people can see the same video and get the same advice. Thank you for watching.